So hi everybody. It's May. It's March third, twenty twenty-three. So I just wanted to weigh in on the uh, student loan repayment situation. You know, my heart breaks for anybody that's in debt. It's it, when we when we signed our mortgage in nineteen ninety-seven. We thought our lives were over. You know, we didn't think we'd ever eat out again. We thought we'd never be able to do anything. But over time, we paid it off, and, 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 and life is good. Now, for those people with student debt, right, well, first off, I don't understand why college tuition is so high. All right? I, I understand that some people at the top of colleges make a lot of money, a lot. And I don't quite get that. All right? it's, I think it's wrong that they get so much. But regardless, some to those people that have um, debt, well, first off, okay, no one forced you to go to college. No one forced you to take that major with which you can't find a job. No one forced you to go to that particular college when other ones might have been less expensive. Okay, there's a lot of variables in there that were under control, all right? And, and you know, between the parents, guidance counselors, and, and the person, they chose a college that was too expensive. They chose a major that was apparently unhirable. You know, you have to do some research before you do these things, right? So there might have been some mistakes in there. Now I, I now understand a lot of people are in that same boat, so it, it is hard to believe that that many people could have made foolish mistakes. But nonetheless, some probably did. And I understand the idea that, hey, I'm in trouble. You know, please bail me out. Well, again, you got yourself into that trouble. Now there's some options here. I am of the military mind. So, you know, one option is to sign up in one of the services, or at least a service that has some kind of student loan repayment program. Yeah, you're going to have some tough going at first, going through basic training, boot camp, whatever that service calls it, and maybe, maybe a tough time after that. But Doing so will help pay off your student loan and give you a job in the meantime and give you a very high quality of life between the medical and vacation time and everything else. Understand there's a low propensity for people to join the military now. That's pretty sorry. Really, really sorry. Okay, The way as tense as the world is right now, it's really a shame that people are saying, oh, I don't want to defend my country. Oh, I don't want to go in the army. Uh, uh, uh. Well, that's pretty freaking sorry. All right. But nonetheless, rather than wallowing on the ground, asking yourself, uh, you know, crying for someone to pay off your loans, do something about it. Make a decision. Make it a tough decision. You join the military for those few years, you're going to get pay, benefits, high quality of life, experience that will help you get your job that your degree apparently can't, get some open your eyes about the world, get that loan almost all, if not all, paid off, you have veteran status for the rest of your life, what's not to do? If you're, if you're mature and you realize the situation you're in, and you're proud enough not to accept the handout, do something about it. Get your butt in the military, or at least research it. Yeah, most people are not qualified for the military. They're too stupid, too heavy, too sick, not smart enough, criminal background, all that other stuff. But for those few that are, that have student loans, that they want to get paid off, See a recruiter. Ask if they have that student loan repayment program like the Army does, like the 
Guard. The National Guard. All right. There are options out there that will let you get that loan paid off or almost paid off where you can walk away with pride rather than saying, hey, look, look what I just got away with. Somebody else just paid for my degree. I didn't do a thing. No, have some pride. Do something for your country instead of sucking off it. Just do something. That's my point of view.